Okay. Hey, everybody. How you doing? I'm doing pretty good. Now, you're probably saying, what? Because <laughs> I posted a video today, actually, this morning, doing this. Um, it was just too much gold. Okay, and I wanted some black in here, too. So, you're better off when you're using a pre-mixed paint. It's just, you know, peel it off before it dries. Completely cures. And it just peeled off like tape. It was pretty easy. So, I'm going to do this again without getting carried away, hopefully, <laughs> on the gold. Because it was just too much, you know? So... I have the bottom of this is a tivet, I guess. <laughs> and the bottom is covered with contact paper. And that's it. I mean, you could probably use it as a pizza thing for your oven or whatever. <laughs> I don't know. It has got this little hole right here, which is nice. You can hang it on the wall. So I thought it was just pretty as a decoration. And I'm using the... Artist Loft Ready Mixed Pouring Paint. I'm using black, old gold. I'm using turquoise. And I'm using violet. Again. Are we? No, we're not. Hold on here. Okay, now we're. <laughs> And uh, this is not the bloom. I just realized that my artist loft, which is mixed with two parts Floetrol, one part paint, and then just a little water to thin it down like we would normally do for our pores, you know, that consistency. And uh, it seems to kind of help lace it up a little. So this stuff, what am I going to do? Just blow on it like I did today, but I'm going to try to save some of the black in there also. All right, here we go. I actually have some left over in another bottle. I'm scared to use it because I don't want chunks, but I might as well. Sometimes. All right. That's about how much I did today. All right, I'm going to uh, spread that around. Okay. So, yeah, if I'm not happy completely, some canvases I'll just leave alone and pour over them. But something like this, I'm just going to get rid of it right away and do it again. So here goes. Uh, all right. <laughs> I was all happy that wasn't a waste of paint. And today, like, yeah, right. That was the turquoise. The purple. And just a little gold. Yeah. Okay. And then, crazy as it may sound, just a dribble of that, and a dribble of this. Yeah. Okay. And now my white. goes slanted. I need to level this table. I'm going to tilt this my direction way so you can see the blowing. Okay. Problem is I never have enough breath. Man. Oh, it's okay, I can finish with the straw. I 
was prettier. Now, okay, yeah, don't have a lot of gold. Now I'm going to finish with the straw in just some areas. Let's check it out now. So here's the handle. Got a few splatters of white right there, but I can touch that up. Move the print now. See, that's beautiful. I don't know why I settled for that. That's gorgeous. And there she is. There she blows. <laughs> yeah. I think strands of stuff going up there would be really cool, but. So I'm gonna take a little bit of white. I'm just gonna go like this in some areas. Okay. Like I said, I can touch that up with black if I mess it up. There we go. That's neat. All right. That just gives it more style. Let's check it out. Pretty cool. Get the middle too, and it's not just all one solid color. And I still got my lacing and flares. <laughs> I'll take pictures of this, and they'll be posted at the end of this video, okay? And you can always go to my uh, description and there's a link to my Facebook business page where you can see clear photos of anything I do on YouTube. Okay? Have a good one. Bye-bye now.